Another benefit of email marketing is that people engage with emails. 25% of sales were attributed to emails. And I'm sure you want to be part of that 25% as well. Of course, I wasn't checking my text messages. I was text checking my email. Like, you know when you get those little red notifications or green or orange, whatever color notification you have on your phone and it is so annoying. Well, I know it annoys me. I have to make sure that I don't see those little notifications. So I always go into my email and delete or read whatever I need to read. Or I just make a little check marks to go back to it later. Now, this segues perfectly well with today's video. Hola mi gente bella y bienvenidos a mi canal. My name is Sandra, if this is your first time here, and welcome to my channel. In this channel, you'll be learning about everything high-end or luxury candle making business tips. So, without any further ado, let's get into the video. As you can tell by the title of this video, we'll be discussing why you should start your email list T-O-D-A-Y today. So let's get into what we're going to be discussing today. Nowadays, giving your email to anyone or any business is as valuable as giving your social security number as if you're applying to get a credit card. Like people value their email addresses because it's where they communicate with other people or other companies and it's another form of mailing service that they have aside from receiving a physical mail. So they don't want to receive spam or unsolicited emails or worthless emails that are just going to be left unread or thrown in the trash and they don't want their email list to be bombarded with emails that obviously they're not gonna read. So you may ask, Sandra, like, what's the importance of having an email list? Like, I already have sales or I don't want to get emails because I don't know what to do with them. Come closer, get a little bit closer. I'm going to tell you a secret. Those people emails that you don't want to collect could be your potential customers. You know when you go to your Candle Science, 1617, Wooden Candle Co., Nature's Garden, Aztec Candles, or any other candle supply store that you visit to get supplies for your business, you know what they all have in common? I bet you don't know what they all have in common. Aside from them selling candle supplies, they all have your email address. They all send you notifications on their new product, on their sales, important information about their store, updates on your orders, they send you coupon codes just for being their customers. And this is a super, very, very, very good tactic to use for sales. They also send you a notification if you went to their page, looked at their product, placed it in your cart, and for some reason or another, you decided that either you really didn't want it or you got preoccupied with something else and you forgot to check out or you closed your web browser or whatever else happened that you didn't complete that sale, guess what? They send you an email reminding you that you left items in your cart and it's ready for you to complete. And oh, by the way, here's a 10% coupon code to complete your order. Isn't that a great sales tactic that you would like to implement in your store? Anyways, emails are a great way to remind customers of your store, of your product, and to inform them about your company or anything else related to your candle making business without being too salesy or without actually having to sell them anything. You can inform them about um, your business and anything that relates to your business, a celebration, or just to say, happy holidays. Well, I hope 
um, that you know that email marketing is by far one of the best ways to get people's attention. It is really accessible for people to look at anywhere they are. People are more than likely to read your email as opposed to seeing your post on Instagram. So you also give more reliable information when you email them. Besides, they gave you their email so that you can communicate with them. And most importantly, they gave you permission to communicate with them. It's like having an invitation to an exclusive party that you've been dying to go to. So you may ask, well, Sandra, how do I get their email list? Like it's so hard. It's already hard enough for me to give out my email. How am I supposed to get other people's emails when they visit my website? Well, the most used strategy is with a discount code. For example, like the one you see on the screen here or here, whichever way I'm going to put it, or just in here. You enter the website and you get a lovely pop up like this one. It has an enticing offer that you can't refuse. And if you're saving money in the process, that's like an added bonus like this one. You fill out the pop-up information, which is your name and your email address, which is the most important one. And then in 2.2 seconds and sometimes less, you get an email from the company thanking you and saying, hey, here's your coupon code. You can use it right away with any purchase. Click this link and it will be applied at checkout. This is what I call hook, line, and sinker. They got you. Now, the second way that you can get um, their emails, aside from creating an enticing offer, is to create a pop-up that will give them information about them through your candles. You're like, huh? Information about them through their my candles? Well, let me explain. Stay with me. What I mean is like giving them a personality quiz such as what scent are you or what does your scent tells people about you or what scent enhances your mood best, you get the point. This strategy is great because people are always wanting to learn more about themselves and if they can answer a quick five question quiz and you can give them the answer, then that's even more amazing. This strategy is also time consuming because you must do a lot of the legwork to create a quiz um, and it's a little bit long because you have to make sure that whenever they click, um, that clicking corresponds to that quiz answer. But I suggest you use a software called Opinion Stage to create your quiz. It is a seamless and easy process to do. They guide you throughout the steps. Um, per, um, opinion Stage is free to sign up. It integrates with your email marketing software. It gives you data. You can customize it, add pictures, you can create a poll. And the best thing is that they have a free plan. And if you want more features, you can get the starter plan for $29.99 a month. And you can get a pre-made quiz or template that they already have. And you can just tailor it to your candle business needs. And you can link it to your pop-up and then at the end of the quiz, you can have the results be emailed to them and that's how you collect their email. This strategy is super effective because you can also tie in the scent in the quiz with the scent that you have in your candle business and add that in that virtually creates um, a sales that you, they could purchase from you. Now, the last... Um, a strategy uh, for you to get emails is by offering a free gift with every purchase. Now, the gift must be a very good gift. I don't suggest giving wax melts for free because that requires your customers to have a melter and if they don't have one, then they're not really going to like that um, incentive. And how do I know is because I actually implemented this before in my store and I was trying to give out um, a free wax melt with, um, with, not with every order, but yes. I was trying to give out a free wax melt 
with every order and to get their email list, their email address at that particular point. And obviously that really didn't work because like I said earlier, um, that everybody has a melter and that everybody likes um, wax melt. But a lot of people do like candles. And the good strategy will be to give a free two ounce um, candle, which is a better alternative because they are already on your site for candles. So why not give them a scent that they haven't tried or a scent that you are trying to get feedback from. Also, that same two ounce candle, they can re-gift it to someone else. So this is like a gift that keeps on giving email type of strategy. And lastly, why should you start an email list? Because like, why not? If YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, or any other social media you use to reel in customers and give them information about your business gets shut down or is down, then you'll have a way to communicate with your customers. Another helpful tip for getting emails is that it's a great way to email your customers so that you can have uh, reviews. After they made their purchase, you wait um, until they receive their items to send them a thank you email. Then you wait a week after um, giving them time to enjoy the candle and then you can ask them how they enjoyed your candle and to leave a review again you give them a link to click to send them to and to make their process that much easier so what is the benefits of email marketing it lets you stay connected with your customers it's a way for you to communicate with them and for you to know if they like something or not and what products you should advertise and what sales are best. It also reaches customers in real time because 54% of people open their emails and don't you want your emails to be part of that 54% statistics? According to the data created by Lithmus, there's 54% of people that open their emails. I know I will want to be that part of that 54%. Another benefit of email marketing is that people engage with emails. 25% of sales were attributed to emails. And I'm sure you want to be part of that 25% as well. Also, email marketing is easy to measure because you have data that tells you a lot about the people that visit your page, people who purchase, and people who enjoy discounts. It's affordable as well. So I know that some are free but have limited functions, but if you get the paid version, it's also affordable, which gives you more options for you to have data to collect. It also allows for targeted messaging, which means you can create emails based on what that group of people like by segmenting them or grouping them together um, in a certain way and knowing um, in a certain way that lets you know what they like, as I mentioned before, like people who like discount. In addition, it increased brand awareness and that is what we want because since we're a small business, um, our brand is not fully known with a lot of people. So getting people's emails addresses lets people and um, past customers know what you offer, where you stand, and where you are. Many people use these emails to communicate with others and is like texting, but in, you know, bigger paragraphs. Okay, so what um, email software system to use in order for you to collect emails? Now, um, I use Constant Contact, which is the email marketing provider that I have on my leads page. If you downloaded my ebook, you've seen that the email I've sent comes from Constant Contact. If you visited my Instagram account, you'll see that I have a lead page directing you to a page where you can get updates on when I launch. It also helps that I'll be giving away one of these spa gift sets, which is inside of this box. Well, I don't have it primarily inside of this box, but I am giving away a spa gift set, which will be in this lovely box. 
um, and plus other goodies if you sign up. You can use my link to get started with Constant Contact. Their plan starts at $20 a month. And if you want more features, but the $20 a month, um, it's a perfect um, step. Um, you don't have to upgrade if you don't want to, but if you do, you could upgrade to the $45 a month plan to unlock even more features than the $20 a month but the $20 a month plan is also very good. They have amazing templates to use. You can create a series of emails in which you can send to your customers by placing them on a timer, and you don't have to manually create those every single time. You create them once, and they send it to people who sign up automatically night and day. I really like that I can get to um, see the updates on the people who subscribe and you could get data on who signed up and who unsubscribed. You can also segment people or group them into um, groups based on their shopping history with you. When was the last time they shopped at your store? What items they enjoyed the most? And so much more in order for you to send them emails that are best for them. Now, I tried MailChimp, which is one of the most popular um, email marketing softwares out there um, in the past, but they were too basic when I tried them for free. And what I needed them to do wasn't working for me. Like I wanted to have a lead page and I wanted them to go through a certain series of emails, but um, the free plan on, and even the paid plan didn't have that option at the time. I'm not sure if they have that now, but um, it didn't have it at the time for me. Plus, it was too complicated and I don't like complications and I'm sure nobody likes complications. So I also, you know, tried other um, avenues and I tried ConvertKit and I also tried GetResponse and none of them were as easy to use as Constant Contact and didn't have, and they also didn't have um, the, the, the specific things that I needed that site to do. Now, Constant Content has such great customer service and they also offer email um, or social media marketing assistance where you can get a specialized marketing professional who works with you. This is a great tool for beginners of social media as they give you tips and strategies for you to implement in your Instagram or Facebook. I do get um, a commission if you use the constant contact or the opinion stage um, link that you could find in the description box below or in the pinned comment down below. Now, let me know which of the three email strategies you will try to implement in your store, such as the first one, which is the discount code. People love saving money. Second one, create a sent quiz. Who doesn't want to learn more about themselves? Or the third one, give something away for free. Free is always the best way to entice someone, especially if you're giving something for free that they actually want. So tell me in the comments what strategy you'll be implementing in your store. Um, comment down below right after you hit that like button or that notification bell so you will be the first to know about my videos and plus it helps other candle makers find my content on the YouTube web. And if you're interested in getting opinion stage for your quiz creations or for getting your email list popping and started, then don't forget to click on the links in the description box um, below or in the pinned comment. And again, these are affiliated links I do get a small commission if you join their website. Until the next one, bye me.